The Australian War Memorial at Canberra, built 30 years ago to commemorate those who gave their lives in World War I, is today a shrine and museum to all wars in which Australians have taken part. Records of famous battles and relics such as this old scout plane, the more recent German Messerschmitt fighter, and the famous Lancaster bomber G for George, remind us of the sacrifices paid by our fighting men in the cause of freedom. As a further tribute to those who did not return, the entire inside wall of the Hall of Memory is to be covered in mosaic. Designer and supervisor of this vast project is Napier Waller, here working in his Melbourne studio on a 40-foot high panel that will cover one wall. Figures of the same size, representing the Navy, Air Force and Women's Services, will cover the other three walls. Tracings are taken from the completed cartoon section by section. Mosaic lines are marked on the tracing, following the natural construction lines of the limbs as much as possible. Small coloured blocks are then glued face down onto the tracing so that the front surface is even on the paper and eventually on the wall. Seventy different colours are being used each identified by number. The tesserae, as the blocks are called, are made in Italy from baked enamelled glass. The finished mosaic will contain six million pieces. In patterns which are repeated, like a window section, and are the same for more than one window, the work of assembly is done by a staff under the control of a monitor, who works from Napier Waller's master plan. As each section is completed, it's packed into boxes ready for dispatch to Canberra. At the memorial, the sections are set out in their right order, then hoisted up into the gantries where mosaic craftsmen apply them to the wall. The walls are rendered with cement and the back of the mosaic is also cemented to keep each of the pieces in place and provide a thick bed for the tesserae to rest in. When the pieces are in position, the paper is peeled off and the mosaic washed and cleaned. This section has taken six months to complete, a labour befitting the solemnity and importance of this memorial. <laughs>